nice boxes were in that mess. Hey, that says team, hey, lift. team lift. Team lift. Well, I don't know what kind of sissies they're getting to lift these boxes. Oh, yeah. Oh, this one says apparel, t shirt. T shirt? What it says. Heck yeah. Where's your knit at? Let's see what we got in here. Let's see what Dave sent us. Bubble wrap T-shirt. Oh, wow. cool! Yeah. Heck yeah! Nice. Thank you, Dave. Size large. Thank you. Size large. Thank you. And size large. I got my nice rip shirt. Though. Rip shirt. What is it? Say it on the back. Right. Maybe a mistake opening it that way, but. There's some direction. Box three, direct. Oh my gosh. That's what we're up against. What? Holy jamoli. That looks complicated. It's not that bad. Nah. Guys, that must be like a. That ties those two pieces together. Springs. springs. These are the springs. This is what people pay big money for right here. That's your shop. Oh, look at that. These are mountain bikes. All over the frame. Whoa, look at that. What does that say right there? Made in Usa. What the heck is Usa? Well, I'm not sure. I haven't seen it in a long time. <coughs> I'm going to have to find somebody who knows how to weld and modify this, I think. I don't know. I do not know. I'm going to get to it. Like I said, i got to find somebody who knows how to weld. You know anybody? D? No. Do you know anybody who can weld? No. Shocks. We got the full front. Shock struts. The full front with the whole suspension. There's everything for the front and the back in here. Shocks, rack and pinion, Mr. rear Mason, suspension. They don't, they don't feel very heavy. These boxes don't feel heavy. This one. This one that says team lift. The other ones aren't. So, like some kind of piece. was there any paperwork? Yeah, right there. This one says team lift too. We can get the team over there. Carton one of four. Carton two of four. Carton three of four. I'm thinking that the where it says carton. It's a set. Yeah, so the rear would be four cartons. Sway bar kit front. And one, that was the engine mount, so that's not part of it. One, two. Looking at that pallet, I was, was a little concerned about their boxing, but. That was just for the shippers to tear up, I guess. Not that they would or nothing, but you know.
kind of fancy schmancy. Is this a roll cage or something? This is a torsion bar. It's going to make it stick to the road like glue. I thought the torsion bar was too small. This could be here. But it has to be on something soft. Yeah, this is Noise. Oh, we gotta check the tops for the rest of them, boy. I think we're okay. No. Um, yeah, on the other ones, I think we're okay. So that's the frame. That's what uh, strengthens the frame and gives you something to mount the suspension to. Oh, nice. got it. That's organized chaos, but it's actually less chaotic than it looks. Got all the front stuff out. I like the way they label all the packages. I mean, look at that package of bolts right there. That's great. I ordered this, the front um, sway bar. I like a sway bar, especially if you're going to do any fun stuff with it. You want sway bar to help the body not roll so much. Um, got the springs laid out, coil over for each side, upper lower control arm, spindle, rack and pinion. What's cool is I set this, I set these brackets in there real quick just to see if we were even close. I gotta check to make sure I got them turned right, but I'm sure I do because this is the only one that fits. But it lines up. One's up good. So that's cool. That won't stay in there. That one fits. No, it fell out too. There it is. All right, so on this too. Make sure these tabs are to the back because you got to cut. See right there? We got to cut that little slot right there where that touches on that side and this side because this has to drop down. It's got to drop down to that. It's just that little bit right there. This lower cradle it fits it puts up right here we got to drill out some of those holes i got to read the directions on that because i know there's a couple of them and i think you want to go through all these holes and make sure they're half inch so the bolts go through without binding up so what else coilovers color springs that's some nice stuff right there you see how nice that is i mean that's like jam up Real nice springs, made in USA. I heard stuff in USA. Used to be pretty good. Got the front spindles. Those are based off of like a 70s, 80s Camaro. We'll have to be creative with the wheels because we might have to run a Chevrolet wheel pattern in the front, forward in the back. I gotta work on that. Need to get brakes ordered. So back here in the back, that is seriously beefy to tie that frame together. Got our cross member, got our suspension mounts, which strengthen up the frame. We gotta cut this notch out though. We gotta figure out how this goes on here because it's been a long day. So this has got to go somewhere in this area. You gotta cut out Something like this. And then I gotta figure out where it is. It may be right there. I'll have to check. But we gotta cut this out. And this flips up like this and fits in that gap. So you're basically boxing that frame. And that's so your rear end can go up and down. Got your, I call it ladder bar. I don't know what everybody calls it now. Got all that stuff right there. Pan hard bar. Oh, that's it right there. That's all the pan hard bar. Got all these nice hind joints. All this, I mean, really good quality stuff. This must be, oh, that's your rear end. That bolts to your rear end to tie the pan hard bar so it doesn't move. Um, 
So, like I said, look at all these packages. Everything's labeled. It's in the directions it goes to it. It's high quality stuff. All of it. So, we're on our way, right? Hardware kit, emergency brake pivot. I think that mounts to the rear differential. I gotta read the directions. I kinda scanned over everything. Made in United States. I bet that's some good stuff. So anyway, we're on our way. Look at that mess up there though. Hey, what are you doing? Huh? Oh, nothing. You know this is good stuff because they got the bubble wrap that actually pops. Anyway, thanks for watching our video. Please check our, our other videos on the channel. Uh, we're on our way to 1,000 subscribers, and if you hit that like and subscribe button and the notification bell, it really helps us out, and it will keep you in touch whenever we want to put another video out involving the truck or anything like that. Uh, big shout out to QA1. Thank you for sending us all this equipment and stuff. Uh, I mean, your stuff is amazing. You can tell by all the, all the packaging that y'all sent. I mean, your stuff is well, well made. Uh, big shout out to James Callahan for designing our stuff for our t-shirts. Huge shout out to Jessica for printing them out for us. If y'all want us to make more t-shirts like this and send them out we're trying to get a merch channel set up leave a comment on stuff that you want to be seen if y'all have already done anything with a qa1 suspension and you had problems that you solved just leave a comment for us because we're really trying to make this as streamlined as possible for anybody that wants to watch and get it figured out on their own we're just trying to make this as simple and as educational as possible so Leave any information you got down in the comments, any questions, just hit us up with that and we'll try and get back to you as soon as possible. All right, we'll see you on the next one. Okay, bye.